Hi you guys, another vlog here. Starting out at the urgent care this morning because my eyes, as you can see, are red and they're swollen and I just, I'm miserable and itchy and blah, blah, blah. My life is so hard, I know. It's totally not, but it's really annoying me. Anyway, so Brad stayed home. I took Will to preschool and then he watched Molly and Max so I could come here, so that was so sweet of him. Uh, basically, there's like a virus going around right now that's like the pink eye sinus kind of virus. I actually had a really sore throat the other day um, and I have the virus and I cannot get my seatbelt in. Anyway, I had the virus, so she got me some ointment and it should go down in two days. So, thankfully, I can get that taken care of. And now I'm gonna go pick up uh, the kids and then go pick up Willie, go pick up my prescription. And then I have a friend coming over today, yay! So that's the beginning of this vlog. I hope you guys, hopefully as this vlog goes on throughout the week, my eyes will get better and better. Hi, Molly. So we're at Will and Max's uh, swimming lessons and oh my gosh, it's so foggy. It's really hot and humid, it's like 80 degrees because it's indoors. Show you guys then because there's like five people standing in the way. Oh my goodness, this is like so foggy. But they're over there somewhere. I can't really see. But they're over there somewhere. Even though it's getting foggy. Those ladies are in the way, so I can't see Willamette. Did you drop my lip gloss? <laughs> Hi you guys. It is now nighttime. I know I have not told you guys like the day or anything. It's Thursday night and I am headed to a blogger kind of thing for the LDS church because I'm Mormon and a lot of the LDS like influencers. Hold on one second. Make sure I don't hit this. Uh, my friend Alicia. She has a YouTube channel. I'll link her down below. But she invited me to come with her because she always gets to go. So I'm all dressed up in fancy clothes. And yeah, I have to go all the way downtown. And hopefully I can make it. And hopefully it will not. Let's see if my garage door goes down. Is it going down? Is it going down? So I will talk to you guys when I get there if it's appropriate. If it's not appropriate, then I'm not gonna do it because that will just be awkward. Okay, there's my garage door. Okay, so let's go downtown. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm here at the Joseph Smith Memorial Building with Alicia and Karina. Hello. And we just got finished. We ate way too much cake. Oh my gosh, yeah. So <laughs> sickening. Like five pieces. Like all we want now is french fries. Or well, that's what I want. What do you want? <laughs> I need something like heavy to weight down all the sugar. Seriously, I'm so hungry. But it was really, really cool. Just like upcoming stuff for the um, LDS church. So I'll share that with you guys when it's time. But look how pretty this building is. It used to be an old hotel. I didn't know that. that. This hotel you taught back in the like early the, 1900s, the late The creme 1800s. de la creme hotel. Yeah, this is like the expensive place to stay. Isn't that cool? Okay, hopefully I don't. Good morning. Today is Friday, February 5th, and it is my baby sister Marcy's birthday. Happy birthday, Marcy. Molly's like smiling so much. She's like, happy birthday, Marcy. Look, she's like, happy birthday, Marcy. Yay! Look at this disaster. This disaster is now because of her because she moves all around. Everything's falling. The boys are wa watching a show really fast. I'm going to my friend Rachel's house this morning. She just moved. So I'm gonna go see her new house. I'm really excited about that. Um, it snowed again. It just keeps snowing. This is like the craziest winter we've had in a long time in Utah. Um, but snow just like everywhere. I can see the lake and all the mountains. I can't see them because of the snow. Also, update on my eyes. I feel like I'm always talking about my eyes, but they're back to being red and itchy again, and I don't know what that means. Kind of makes me nervous, but I'll wait out today and see. I'll keep putting the medicine on and see how it goes. So yeah, I'm gonna make some breakfast. You guys can't see me at all right now, but I'm gonna make some breakfast, and then we're gonna head to preschool, and then I'm gonna head to my friend Rachel's house. Yeah. Okay, so it is hours later, and I, oh, this, that was so nice. I'm here at Costco and my windshield is horribly dirty because I ran out of windshield wiper fluid. So he was taking snow and wiping it on my windshield so I can just turn it on. It's that guy, kind guy over there. He's so nice. Every time I come to this Costco, he's so nice. Anyway, we had a really crazy morning. I went to Target really fast and then we took Will to preschool and because I wanted to take my friend Rachel who just moved into a new house I wanted to get her like a little um, Housewarming gift so I got her like a candle and then I went to her house and then I was late picking Willie up from preschool Huh Will? I want to go play at Rachel's house. We'll go there another time. It's really cool yeah. 
so yeah, and now I'm just getting gas at Costco. So that has been my crazy morning. People are watching me, but I don't even care. It's another like cold day, but it's sunny at least. And I need to fill up my windshield wiper fluid because it's driving me crazy. Okay, you guys ready to go back home? Good morning, you guys. It is Saturday and I am here at Costco. I just went to the doctor again because look at my eyes. They're crazy again. They're red and itchy and swollen. And the doctor said that it was um, like an allergic thing. And so I just got these different, I got eye drops or whatever. So hopefully, and then they gave me like a steroid thing to take down the inflammation. Cause I have to film some videos today for millennial moms and I'm stressing out because my eyes look so bad. Anyway, so I'm gonna go into Costco cause I am Sam's kids. And it's kind of a sad way to spend my Saturday cause I wanted to like, you know, hang out and get some stuff done. But Costco it is, you guys. So <laughs> let's go to Costco. Hi you guys, I know it has been a while since I have vlogged because of my crazy eye situation. I'm currently at a red light and I'm going to get my eyebrows waxed and shaped. It has been two years since I have had them <laughs> shaped or waxed, or a year and a half I should say. And apparently this girl is like insane amazing. A lot of my friends in my neighborhood use her and their eyebrows are like always on fleek. I feel so nerdy seeing that because I'm not cool. I'm like a 31 year old mom but hopefully I will make it on time. And yeah, let's head to my salon eyebrow appointment. Okay, so I just got my brows done and look how amazing they look. So Alana or Alana? Alana. Alana, okay, I had a friend named Alana. So she has her own brow product line and I wanted to show it to you guys. She's being shy, she doesn't wanna be on camera, but I'm gonna show you guys her product. And do you have a website too? I do, salonprecy.com. Salonprecy.com and these are her products and she's developing more products but you guys, I am in love with my brows. I've never loved my brows as much as I do now. So, let's show this here. So she's coming out with more stuff too. So, come on, focus camera. So this is the powder, and I love this packaging. Look at that. And then here's the spoolie, and this is the brush, which I loved. And then the highlighters, and the tweezers, and the amazing part, so mine was the Megan. Yeah, you are Vegas. She has these stencils that make it really easy to fill in. How amazing is that? Oh my goodness, I'm obsessed and love. I still can't get over my brows. I'm so obsessed with them and she was so sweet and so nice. We like hugged at the end because we both just just hit it off. We hit it off. Um, anyway, if you guys live in Utah, her salon is right here, Salon Per Se. There it is, Percy, there you go. Anyway, see Alana, her daughter also does facials there, and so I think I'm gonna do a facial next time I come, but she changed my brow life. Like, I am, I am like backing up and doing this, this is kinda sketchy. But she changed my life. I'm so excited about getting my brows done. I'm like, I'm deaf, she's like, well if you come back, I'm like, no, I will be back here, lady. You are amazing. I love them, love them so very much. Hi you guys, it is like 6 a.m on Wednesday morning, but I am wide awake and I just figured, you know what, I'll just edit this video for you guys today and kind of get all this vlog footage to you guys because it's been a while. Um, I just wanted to explain to you guys also, I'm like really tired looking, sorry. I wanted to explain to you guys kind of what's been going on and why I've taken a little bit of a break, just like for a week or so. Um, a lot of you have been asking me like, where are your videos and everything? So I wanted to explain that to you guys because I always keep it real with all of you guys. Basically what's been going on is a few weeks ago I realized that I have postpartum depression and I could do an entire video about that. And if you guys want me to, comment down below as always and let me know. But I just realized how unhappy I was for no reason at all and I just felt really, really low. And I've never had postpartum depression before. I've had depression, but not postpartum. And I feel like there's a lot, there's a big difference between that um, because I didn't recognize it uh, because I had never had it before and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, long story short, I'm getting the help that I need. Um, I'm seeing my therapist again. She's so great and she comes to my house and it's fabulous. I really don't want to be on medication. Um, for it and that's totally fine you know that people are I'm not like anti-medicine 
in general, but I just feel like it's not that bad that I feel like I need it. I feel like I have it under control because I recognize it and I feel like I'm doing so much better already this week, which is fabulous, finally. I also finally figured out what was wrong with my eyes. I was allergic to Aquaphor, which is crazy because I was getting medicine that was making my eyes really dry. So I put Aquaphor on them and then the more I put Aquaphor, the more swollen my eyes got. So that was crazy. But my eyes are back to normal, which is so nice. I never, I just realized how much I took it for granted that I could like put makeup on or put lotion on them. You guys know what I mean? Anyway, so that's kind of what's been going on. I feel like I, was just completely overwhelmed and it put me in like this really huge slump. I just couldn't say no to anything and that's a big problem. And it's just so interesting having more kids and having a real job. Like YouTube now is a job for me. I love it and I'm passionate about it and that's why I will never quit it. Uh, but I just had a lot of organizing to do to kind of figure out the timing of everything and time with my husband and time with my kids and time to do this and that's why i'm up at 6 a.m doing this because i wanted to do it um while all the kids are still asleep anyway so that's kind of what's been going on thank you guys so much for understanding i kind of just put everything on hold for the last week and a half or so just to like take a chill pill you know what i mean so i will be back in full force i'm planning on doing two videos a week and then my millennial mom so i'll have three videos a week for you guys that's kind of like my new plan i think i was overdoing it with the four videos a week for you guys and maybe once i start feeling better then i can do that but right now i wanted to take care of my mental health and my physical health and all of that and i love you guys so very much you guys are so fabulous also if you guys don't know my sister started a youtube channel all about books and she is an incredible writer and she's always loved reading she was an english major she's super intelligent super smart and she loves finding um kid books to talk about adult books she's just gonna be amazing so if you guys are into books into reading i will have her channel linked down below and yeah that should be it so thanks you guys so much for watching i have a lot of exciting stuff that i am vlogging this week that I'm excited to share with you guys as far as just like my day-to-day -day life. But yeah, so thanks for watching and we'll see you guys later. Bye!